This is Team Minimo Post here bringing you with a brand new video, and today we're going to be talking about the new Gladiator Beast Fusion coming out of Collector's Pack 2017. And it is actually kind of a very decent card. It's not very hard to summon, even though the, the, the requirements look pretty insane. So let's just jump right into it. So this is Gladiator Beast Adabante. It's a Dark Beast Warrior Fusion Effect Monster that's level 8, 1000 attack, and 2800 defense. And it requires Gladiator Beast Augustus and two other Gladiator Beast monsters, or actually just two more Augustuses if you can manage to pull that off. So for those of you who don't know who Geyseris is, or not Geyseris, or Augustus is, excuse me, uh, it reads as follows. It's a uh, Dark Wing Beast effect monster, level 8, 2600 attack, month as a defense, and the effect reads as follows. Um, when this card is special summoned by the effect of a Glider Beast monster, you can special summon one Glider Beast monster from your hand in face of defense position. Shuffle this card, or shuffle it into the deck during the end phase, um, which is kind of the same thing i'm not going to read the second because they're basically the same thing all over for uh, most of the gladiator beast monsters i think it's minus like endel and a few others um but what you're going to do is what if you once after you special summon this card through like bestiarius executor you're going to want to um special summon darius activate darius's effect special summon another uh, gladiator beast from the graveyard like hoplimus or um or bestiary or secutor again and then you can have the materials to summon uh this card also you can't special summon a uh, gladiator beast uh uh, you, you, you have to special summon this card from the extra deck using the cards above. That's basically the same thing for all contact fusion monsters. Uh, it's, it's the same thing here. All Gladiator Beast fusion monsters have this stipulation. So let's just jump right into this in the, in the two effects. The first effect is if, if this card is special summoned this way, you can special summon one level 7 or lower Gladiator Beast fusion monster from your extra deck, ignoring its summoning conditions. Basically, this what this does is allow you to special summon Geyseris for basically nothing. Um, and then once you get to, when, then once you do that, you get the pop two cards using Gazeros' effect, which is pretty good. And then not only that, you can actually attack with Gazeros and then attack with this card, then activating Gazeros, Gazeros and this card's effect to shuffle them into the extra deck or put them back into the extra deck, and then special summon I think two or four monsters, uh, two three uh, um, three or four monsters for um, those two cards, which is really good. Um, which means you can have a lot of a lot of on field advantage after after the turn that this card battles, and that's pretty good. Um, which all of them also have this stipulation. I think all the fusions at this point have this stipulation where if you if they battle a card, then you could just you could just shuffle it back in the extra deck or put it back in the extra deck, and then special summon X amount of monsters for it. But I think this is a very good card. It's not very difficult to summon. Uh, I think at most though, uh, if you're gonna play Augustus, you're probably playing it at one. Just so you, just because it's not very difficult to summon, but I don't really see you playing it at three because I think three you probably just die in your hand a lot of the time. But uh, I think it's actually a pretty decent card. So, anyway, guys, tell me what you guys think about this card in the comment section below. I'll see you guys in the next video. This has been Team at Metamorphos, and I'll be signing out.